Alright, what is going on, you beautiful motherfuckers? It's Trout here. And, um, I think that should be good. I got this new, like, holder stick, selfie stick type deal for my camera. And I'm hoping that it looks fresh. Like, I could just, like, mantle it up, you know? But, this is gonna be the intro to the first video of my adventure Q&A series that I'm thinking about doing. I'll see how this one goes out. I actually haven't asked for any questions yet at this point um, because I plan, this is uh, this is the plan, like I said. Me and Dave are gonna go to this like abandoned cement factory that you can climb like 45 feet in the air, I think. I'm not really sure. No one's actually measured it, I'm just guessing. We're about to go there right now. And uh, cause I, I was gonna just go there at night because me and Dave have climbed it before, but I'm planning on doing a lot of cool stuff with it. Um, but you guys won't be able to see most of it because it'll be at night. I'm gonna bring like a spotlight and a lantern and stuff. But to get the actual footage that I want, I'm gonna go there now. Yeah, I'm gonna ask for questions and then uh, I'm gonna show you guys this place real quick in the light. And then, uh, yeah, bye. Okay, really bad. Now, what if we really understand it? Like the gates were open. <laughs> I'm purposely yeah, filming the private property sign to be a cop. So, we're leaving now. As you can see, they actually changed a lot from what me and Dave thought it was going to be since the last time we got here. Um, for one thing, they got rid the road of the bottom ladder, so you kind of have to parkour your way up to even do it. Also, they added a lot of no trespassing signs that weren't there previously, and that was kind of our excuse. Uh, whenever people would ask why we were back here, like, there's no signs. So, they did add signs, however. So we couldn't stay here long in the daytime. We'll probably come back tomorrow night after the video. See you there. <laughs> Finished buying all the shit at Walmart and we're headed there now. Squaw! Alright, it's going. Okay. Alright, guys, we are currently walking this sketchy ass path to, uh, to hopefully the tower that you guys saw already. And uh, we'll, we'll, we'll keep you posted. There we go. We got, we got some blood and semen. It all looks pretty fresh, I'd say. It looks like a woman gave a natural birth <laughs> in the concrete. <laughs> All right, let's keep moving, boys. <laughs> so, uh -huh. <laughs> so we have we've made it, and like I said, the ladder's gone. So we're gonna have to find our own way to that station right there. There. All of this. All right, we're we're all working on climbing up. We got a long way up to go. All right, so. I'm trying to use the light as, as least as possible. So as you guys can see, it's uh we're not up top yet. There's like the there's like the third story. We still got a little bit more to go. And uh where's the front? There it is. I know you guys can't see me, but a little more to go. Don't want to use the lights, we don't want the cops to come, so see you in a bit. We made it up. As you can see here's the the view we got. Um it's pretty dope actually. I think it's like 45 feet in the air. 
we are you gonna get a view like this, man? If you look out far enough, you can see the city of Jacksonville. Those lights way down, I doubt you could see it. Maybe. We're gonna get this shit started. Bales, put in some clouds. I'll put in some eerie music. <laughs> And now, <laughs> it's the star of the show. <laughs> Alright, let's try to keep it right there, hold it steady. Okay. Steady. Screenshot of these all on my phone, it's gonna take a while. How did you start your YouTube career from Caleb Barrera? Well, my job is not YouTube, first of all. But I've been making videos for about a year now, I think. And about three months into that, I met Sam. And that's when, uh, El Angle it up, like, all right, so yeah, so about a year ago is when I hit 100 subs, I think, and that's really when I started, but it's not really a career. I work a full-time job, or a part-time job, and I'm at school, so there you go. On a scale of 1 to 10, how far did you get when you saw the Vimana remodel? <laughs> it's a good one. Hey. I mean, a lot of guys, people don't like it, but I think it looks like Aang. I think it's pretty dope. So, I saw it 8. I'm gonna edit out all these awkward silences, by the way. I like these, though. I can say whatever I want, and it won't be there? Is that... <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> these are gonna be edited out right yeah. now? <laughs> this far right now? <laughs> yeah, you're good. No one's gonna know about this. Nice. <laughs> Would you suck Rexy off for poolside? Yes. 100%. For free. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Do you ever play with your fans? Love your vids, bro. Been here since 1K. Yeah, when we stream, which I don't do very often, as you guys know. Um, but once I get back into streaming, totally, my boy. I forgot to tell who... I'll post the, the screen caps of everyone who asked the question, so don't worry. Right. Does Lightning McQueen get car insurance or life insurance? <laughs> that's, that's a good one. Uh, I mean, I imagine he has to get both, you know? Because if your car breaks down, he's got to get the new parts for it. But then if he dies, like... Well, if you don't have family, then what's the point of life insurance? He's and got he a doesn't. point. He doesn't have a family. He's just banging that Porsche. Hey. That's a good question, Dark Magician. <laughs> Alright. XD or XD? Be careful. This is difficult. I'm more what? of an XD kind of guy. You know, like the laughing face. XD. XD yeah. I'm more of an XD guy. XD. I don't know. I, 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 I do a little bit of both to answer your question. First stop using Movie Maker when you edit. Probably I'm going to have to for this video, but like for the rest of them. Fuck now, dude. Movie maker for life. Um, how did you meet Sam and Rexy? Sam, I met through his stream. Like I said, like a year ago. And uh, I was just like, I subbed him a while ago. And then we started playing together. And uh, yeah. And then Rexy, uh, he invited me to play some casual sieges with him on stream. And then we just added each other and playing together ever since. And then, you know, we met at Worlds, obviously. You guys saw that. And we're bros for life. Do you like high school? Did you like high school? And how did you meet all your smite buds? Well, I already talked about that. High school was pretty chill. I mean, I wrestled the whole time, so it was awful. But uh, as far as did I like it, it was all right. I'd say a seven out of ten at best. And how'd you meet all your smite buds? I already pretty much talked about all that. Dave, I know in real life, he's the one holding the camera. Sorry. Um, I already mentioned Sam. Rexy was pretty much through Sam, and then Punk Doc or Ed was through Rexy, I believe. Yeah, I think we were, I think Rex is like, yo, dude, we're doing a drunk stream, you down? I was like, fuck, yeah, so then, and then, we, and then I saw I'd stick at Worlds, you guys know that, we've been bros ever since. <laughs> if you could fuck a god, who will it be? Alright, well that, alright, um, either Neith or Aphrodite for sure. Yeah. Right? Is there any contest? I don't know. Um, or B Bacchus. Bacchus. Oh. <laughs> Easy. Obviously. Trelly, who's your favorite god? Once again, Bacchus. <laughs> All right, who's better, Dave or Dave? <laughs> Someone said Dave by far. He said, "Yeah, I thought so." Oh. I mean, Dave's all right, honestly. I, wow. Six and a half out of ten at best. All right. Have you ever this eaten ass? Going on. I, I've I've said this and I stand by this. I've never eaten ass, but I will. <laughs> That's a hundred percent fact. Whoever. Whoever wants to present their ass, for sure. And how big is Punk Duck's dick only asking for a friend? I'm not allowed to disclose that information. But he did try to pee on me. Fails. Just because you didn't know that. It's a fun... I'll tell you later. <laughs> Are there any drugs in your life? Not recreationally. Sometimes. Every once in a while. 
not much. I've smoked weed like twice, which is, yeah, that's about it. <laughs> not really, I just drink pretty much now. All right, this question will seem out of the blue, but what are your plans for the foreseeable future, like college and career plans? Um, I'm, in, I'm in college right now, and the foreseeable future? If you mean, like, <coughs> I think you mean, like, coming soon, not, like, far. I think that's what foreseeable means, not sure. Yeah, sure. Um, as for now, I'm just going to keep going to class and making vids and streaming, and we will see from there, my dude. And as for a career, I mean, I'm getting a degree in, like, computer management, and that seems pretty lame, but if it comes to... Are you gay? Now, this is a good one. I like that this guy put thought into this. Yeah. Someone said, God, I hope so. <laughs> no, I'm not gay, but... <laughs> Yes. <laughs> uh, can I have mod, V cry, go fuck yourself? Um, are you doing parkour in this video? Not really, we just had to climb a ladder and I'd, some sketchy I'd railings. Say yeah. So, uh, kind of. Kind of. Uh, I don't even want to answer that one or that one. <laughs> Where are you from? Originally from Pennsylvania, now I live in Florida. As I said, that's the city of Jacksonville, way over yonder. It's really far away. You can't actually figure out where I live from that. It's actually like really far away, but it's just felt we're really high up and you can see the lights. Um, thoughts thoughts on kinks such as foot fetishes. I mean, I personally don't have a foot fetish, but I don't mind if you have a foot fetish. You know, you do you, man. Whatever gets you off. Will you ever play Smite on console? I have before. My connection used to be total shit, so I I have played Smite on console. As for if I will again. If someone gives me a large amount of money, probably. How old are you? I'm 19. How did you decide YouTube was the career for you? Was it hard to reach where you are today? Any advice giving someone starting their own channel? Like I said, YouTube is not my job. I mean, it's a small form of income compared to my minimum wage job, if that helps you understand anything. Um, was it hard to reach where you are today? I mean, I have some dope friends, and the videos were all just, I just did them for fun. I wasn't really trying to reach anywhere, per se. So no, not really. I just kind of uploaded and chilled. Um, any advice someone making a channel? Just be consistent, I'd say. And just do what you want to have fun and fuck what everyone says. And do you work out? No, I used to. Like I said, I wrestled in college from... Not college, high school. I wrestled in high school from 7th grade to 12th grade. And then I decided I wasn't going to wrestle anymore in college. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much what got me in the shape I'm in today, and I haven't worked out in, like, years. That's it. I, uh, x a bunch of the weird questions, because I've answered a lot of your guys' weird questions when I was drunk on stream, and I'll probably continue to do so. So, all those weird questions. If you want to, and there's probably videos of me answering a lot of weird questions. Uh, yeah, that's gonna be it. Uh, this is, this has been my 6K adventure Q&A with this random-ass emoji that I wanted to get. We are on top of a random tower. It's really late at night, and I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go home. So if you did enjoy, leave a like. It's Pintrelli, guys. Peace.